If you've been writing CSS for a while, you probably know about border radiuses where you can do something like this, 50%, and if it's a square, it gives you a circle. Uh, you can also put multiple values here. So we can do a 25% right there, and it gives us a weird shape like that. So it's doing these two at 50% and then these two at 25%. But did you know you can also come in and actually put a forward slash between these and get some interesting shapes that come out of them? Because what this is doing is it's splitting it across the same one. So the vertical and the horizontal one are actually changing, and you can come in with different values here. And it doesn't have to be percentages. You could do this with fixed values as well. And you can see there, I'm getting this really weird shape where each corner is just a little bit different. You can do this for all four sites independently because border radius is a shorthand and you can come up with some really interesting blobs and different types of shapes with this.